I just got to the garage um, I'm, I'm actually very happy I got the slips all said and done um, now I'm gonna be focusing on something a little different on this car what I'm going to be doing today is uh, I'm waiting for my friend Joel to come from his garage we're trying to get something there um, what we're gonna do today is we're gonna be dropping the subframe on the EK coupe because I have a manual rack right here that needs to be put on the subframe but i want to take everything out you know clean up the subframe make sure everything's not all nice and yeah so i'm gonna start getting things set up here um i like i said i just got to the garage so there's no no lights are on right now so i'll get that started and yeah all right guys i clean up some of the area so um just waiting for them i'm gonna be lifting this car up soon and we're gonna start taking the wheels off and everything but yeah let me turn on the generator so we can get some light in here i might not be explaining a lot of what we're doing here so i'm just gonna try to show as much as i can and if i can and talk and just tell you guys what we are doing then i will stop and i will try to explain the best i can all right we got the generator all set we got light in here i'm gonna turn on the uh the light in the back i forgot to turn it on here we go Alright guys, we're about to start getting ready. I'm going to start taking these lines out. Uh, I'm going to try to record the best I can, like I said. The most that the phone will be is around this area. Um, just because I can't really be holding the phone and stuff like that, but yeah. We're going to continue on. A little sneak peek of what's coming. Let's get back to work though, for real, for real. Let's get back to work.
we took the suspension out and the spindles on both sides. Now we're lubricating the lower control arms to take them off. And then we're gonna be heating up the subframe bolts so they don't get stripped or get messed up during the process. Yep. Since these bolts have never been taken off before, we have to we have to use we have to apply heat. You want me to turn the fan down? We will get back to you guys once we take these lower control arms off because my phone is acting up and my phone is also dying. So we will get back to you guys once they're completely off. I can spin freely yeah. and I hear the rust binding that means I could go take it out for you you got a three the three eights wow. it's a pitola uh -huh. yeah I do yeah. 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 these always got their own size so you won't combine them so honestly you'll know this is the big one came out of here See, it's not gonna thread. It's not big enough. Pause. This one, obviously, perfect. Okay, there's two more. I'm and actually, I think there is one too. One for sure. That's true. What about four? Damn, Chulo J, you should have been here. You should have been here helping us out, but instead, you're home. Jacking off and doing nothing. He's tired, bro. You play basketball. He's tired. He even won the championship last night. You know? Yeah, won the championship. Just to let you guys know, Chulo J is a tryhard. J is a tryhard, and he's a bandwagon.
Acho, papi, eso enfrenta. Wow. It's so friend, ya. Now it's time for you to slack and sleep. What do you mean, slack and it's sleep? I work like I do. Man. I come here every week and I work on this shit. You gotta wait, ya, to work hard. Yeah, 10 seconds, I bring there. 10 seconds, 10 seconds. Remember, this is showing real time. So if you don't do 10 seconds, you can't hang. 10 seconds, 10 seconds, 10 right there. Yeah, yeah. All right guys, so we took the subframe out of the car. All the subframe bolts we had to heat up and Take them out very slowly, but we got them all out. And now I'm gonna end the video here because this is like all the time that I have. Uh, but next time I do come, I'm gonna be taking all these lines out, uh, the exhaust, take it out and the lower control arms. But yeah, guys, this video was recorded kind of weird because my phone kept acting up. But um, next time I do come, like I said, I'm gonna be taking those lines out. And then I'm going to be cleaning up this uh, subframe and taking off the rack. Hopefully I can do that in one video without a problem. Um, but yeah, guys, um, I know this was a short video, but I really needed content. So I just went ahead and did this quick. Plus, I want to get this ready because I may or may not be painting my engine bay. So I want to be cleaning under where the subframe was and taking all the lines out just to make sure everything is all clean because I'm going to be prepping, I'm going to be prepping to paint down here as well, so yeah. Sadly, the generator had to be shut off, but uh, yeah guys, uh, we did take out the subframe, um, control arms and everything, and uh, like I said, the next time I come, I'm definitely going to be cleaning this subframe and um, taking out the um, rack because I do have a manual rack right here with another subframe, but this subframe is damaged right here. They're all stripped out. So I'm just gonna use mine and swap out the manual rack. And yeah, uh, I know this video was pretty short, but uh, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe if you can. It'll be appreciated. see you guys in the next one just another glimpse of how empty all this looks all right guys peace